Welcome everyone, this is probably the first phone to be able to run Fortnite on Android at the max graphics settings. So of course this is the ROG7 Ultimate and let's have a look at the graphics settings that we have available. So if we go to the settings here, we can run this game Epic Graphics on 100% 3D resolution at 60. If you set the game to 90 FPS, the quality goes to low and low honestly looks terrible just being honest like it is very bad uh, one thing to note though is when fortnite was available on ios uh, the ios version of fortnite was a hundred times better optimized um, you know the ipad pro 2018 which has worse graphics than this phone worse cpu than this phone could run this game at 120 fps at similar graphics and the low on android is actually lower than the lowest on iOS, if that makes any sense. So medium on Android is low on iOS, epic on Android is high on iOS. So this phone, um, while it's really powerful, it is limited by the game, just not being optimized well. But I'm gonna play this game for a couple of minutes. I suck at Fortnite, if I die, I'm just gonna spectate until we reach the eight minutes mark. And the frame rate is right there. Uh, in the lobby it's 30, but in the game it will go to 60. I have played this, if you just want a quick summary, the game actually does like drop, if you do like really quick turns, it may drop every now and then. So let's see here, if I'm at 60. It's not happening now, it just, it happens quite rarely. Um, you can see 57 there, but you're not dropping below like 55 FPS and the phone stays cool, there's no thermal throttling with or without the air active cooler. And uh, just know if you are a content creator that you can't output via HDMI if you have the Air Active Cooler connected. If you don't have the Air Active Cooler connected, you can output via HDMI, but you are limited to 60 Hertz on the screen. So you can't play this game at 90 FPS. If I find a workaround to that, I will have a, a video in the description that you can look at. And um, yes, if there's no video in the description, that workaround hasn't been found. And with that being said, enjoy the gameplay. I'm useless at this game, but you know, uh, I'm gonna cut now.
All right, that will end it for the gameplay. So you can see the phone is staying out, you know, 32 degrees. That's very cool. Um, the screen is like very slightly warm to the touch, but when I say very slightly, it's just like not cold, you know what I mean? And on top of that, the game, there was very slight hitching when you first land into an area, and I landed into the most populated area. But uh, when you fight people, no lag. When this guy like does his sword or God knows what he does, <laughs> oh, that guy's garbage. I lose that guy, but you know, everything runs well. It runs very well. This is definitely the best Fortnite mobile experience. You could also bind these two back buttons. These two impossible to bind. I mean, you can bind them, but pressing them, <laughs> good luck. So you could have aim, shoot, and then like slide, jump, something like that. And um, yeah. So thanks for watching and uh, make sure you leave a like, just help support the channel whatever you can, binge watch my videos, bye bye.